right. I think, you know, even just kind of looking around at our different team, you know, you can see the energy level that's so different. You know, fire is fired up, ready to go. And you can see our water teams really, they're nervous, you know. they That match did not go the way that they wanted to. And the momentum is 100% with the, with the fire team right now. Mm -hmm. It should update in a second. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay. Yeah. So here we're back to Ilios. We, we're going to end it on a uh, control. Oh, we got a Sombra. Here. Oh no, maybe not. Maybe just kidding. I think the difficulty is figuring out. You know what is going to work for these teams. Oh, what you do? They've tried a couple things. Try to get some picks. Uh, I think they're switching around a lot of roles. I don't know if you've been noticing, but our team up there has really been alternating between. You know what's going to work for me. Our fire team's pretty much been keeping the same sort of setup over time here, and it's been working for them, so you know, if it's not broken, you should probably not fix it. Or you can't fix it. Don't broken, don't fix it, something like that. All right. You want to improve at that point. Improve. Right, exactly. So here we go. We're coming out of the gate here. Symmetra's an interesting pick, but I think we can make something happen here. Awful Gator trying to get a quick pick here on some people getting behind the team. It's Zarya is just on him. Quick. Winston's asleep. That's scary. Oh, nice pick. All right. We got two picks coming down here. And this is really where I think we're going to see this Tracer just start to really do a lot of damage. It's just not going to be easy for them to take over that point. But, you know, they were able to still cap it. We'll see. Oh, getting hooked there. Not a good timing for them as fire team continues to hold on to the point and kind of make things make it their game. That's kind of what they've been doing this whole time. Sometimes I also wonder, did we set up these expectations with the team names? You know, like fire is going to be the ones that are like taking over the water. But water yeah. should douse fire. I guess so. We got to see some dousing right now. Yeah. There I still go. have hope Boom. for water. There we go. Okay. Making something happen. Let's got rid of their damage dealer. Let's go in there. There we go. Fire's picking it up. A big res coming in. Just undoing a lot of the hard work that they're doing. Yeah. It's just hard to hold it. And I think, again, you know, when you don't have that momentum, you don't have that energy, it's really easy to get down on yourself. You start making some dangerous moves. You know, a lot of people call it tilt, but that's probably the best way of putting it. And, I think sometimes you just lose focus on what's going to be the smart play in effort for the dangerous and risky plays. Big ult coming in here right now off at Ninja. Just got to hang back, get some picks, but... Awful Gator could time this ult here. Yeah, maybe. Nope. Or charge right that. that. Oh. Yeah. Sipping around, trying to cause some sort of distraction, give his team a hope and a prayer. Some sort of opening, some sort of opening. There we go. After the healer, maybe? No, no. This isn't going to happen. Sentry getting ready with this ult. He's taking up the high ground, so he's hoping. Nope. Mm -hmm. Get distracted. This could be an opportunity to make something happen, but they're running out of time. They got to drop on that point. And again, just getting shut down. There's no opportunity to make anything happen here. It's really tough here. Fire's gonna take on our first point again here. Wow. <laughs> uh, Should have maybe. This is one of those moments there. As a tournament organizer, I wonder: Did I organize these teams well? No comes to mind is no. the answer to that. No. <laughs> no is is where I'm thinking, but um, but we're we're still working here. We're gonna see what we can do. Well, we got a May in here, maybe turn the tides a little bit. I mean, they're, they're looking to try and make something yeah. happen. You can see, you know, Team Water is switching stuff. They want to make it work. I don't know. We're going to see what we can do to kind of make some stuff happen here. Coming in. 
So Farah, ooh, has an opportunity for big boop here. But they, yeah, they back down, is... they decide not to go that way. It's probably the right move. Team Water is taking over our point first, and you know, getting it for some points, pretty good advantage. Farah's playing smart right now, conservative. There we go, we got a lot of Yeah, I can boop off boots. right there. A little bit of a miss. Yeah, that's wow, there we go, nice. The kill there. nice All right, job. good, so that knocks out one of their tanks out of the way. Now they only have to deal with one. Ooh, just this is a big, this could go. be a game changer right here. Get that healer out of the way. You're going to see this ult coming up. Yeah. An ult in that room can really be devastating. We're this see is, right here, here we go, behind the shield. Two, no, charging all. Oh. Dang. Just wasn't able to make that happen. Ninja's it looked good. Gone. I could see that opening. Ninja's just not letting anything happen. Just constantly shutting down the enemy. Read into some of this stuff. All right, right Centrin's just... playing smart from a distance. To start that, gonna... he's pulling that Rhine off. While his other team, the rest of his team, comes from the side. Don't charge that Zarya. Oh. It is not high noon. It is not high noon. It's going to be hard to make that play work. You don't have a whole lot of things to act behind. He's really not able to get these kills. They've got a really strong team there, and that Roadhog's just waiting for picks. That Anna just lands a great grenade. They just don't have the things to block it. They're comfortably, the fire team is comfortably sitting on the point right now. They are having a cookout right now on that point. All right, Ooh, come on, Zarya. Nice. I like that move there. Gotta hide it on the. See, I think so. Zarya's target, I think they need to pick off. I think the missing link is they need to pick off the, the healers and the rest fall. I don't know what the damage deal is on the other team, but. They're just not giving them an opportunity to just make anything happen here. Every single play like that gets started, fire team is in there intercepting it. Look at all their players on fire. There's not a player on the fire team that's not literally on fire at this moment. Yeah. They're playing very strong right now. Unexpectedly so, if I can be honest. Yeah. Alright, little beat drop getting in there. Knight just not able to make that jump. Blow him up. Ooh. Oh, all right. Picks all up right. a kill there. Alright. An opportunity to kind of shut down it's this. Earth has spot. all the pieces there to make this move. They have the pieces there. It's not gonna be enough. Oh, there we go. Ah. Alright. We're seeing them kind of collapsing right now. This could be the opportunity. Got to make this land. Oh man, again, just just enough to shut it down the pressure. Just enough, every That's single it. time. Wow. So uh, Echo Zaza, if you're referring to these guys as in uh, myself, Random and Maverick, uh, mm. I <laughs> I don't know if good is very generous. I'd say we're I'm a fair player. We've got some pretty high ranked people on these teams. Yeah. I think you know we we did balance it out. Best we could. Yeah. yeah, we wanted to make sure, we wanted to try and keep it as even as possible. But unfortunately, I think we're just not able to kind of make some stuff happen here. Alright, I am not giving up on water yet. Ooh, just missed that mess. I'm not giving up I'm on water. I'm not giving up on water either. This is going to be their opportunity to yeah. squeak a win out of here and make it happen. They need yeah. to get fired up and get excited. You need to they see a leader emerge, pull these pull these different uh, player combinations together. I want to see some alts linked here, some combo. Oh no, grabbed Jeez. again. Hooked, picked off. You know, I think it's moves like that where I think people are just kind of overestimating yeah. and overplaying their hands. You're seeing this desperation on that team. You know, yeah. We got Genjis, we got Tracers, they're just trying to they're trying to be the playmakers. Mm -hmm. the team is losing a lot of synergy right now, which... Oh, way to use business buzzword there. Yeah, synergy. But they're doing it. I mean, this is... When teams are not in sync, you can, you know, you can definitely tell. And to be fair, this is the first time these players are together. Yes. So I can understand how that tends to happen. Week one right here. I'll be very excited to see this team in a couple weeks in the future when I think they've got an opportunity to really figure out, you know, what are we what are we good at here? What do we, what do we want to play? 
Well, and also, I kind of want to get a good look at the field here, but I also feel as though they're a little spread out, which also doesn't help as well. We're not seeing a lot of grouping up. We're seeing just a little bit of poke. Not so much like a trickle in, but I'm seeing some of those key damage dealers poke out a little bit, and then they get more than they than they wanted. We're seeing this alt here yeah. come in. Yeah. See, Trace, I'm going to see what Tracer does with the... Oh, she's regrouping. Okay. And again, fire team is just... Not allowing them to have any space or room to Nothing. Move. They're playing as if every single play is the end of the game. <laughs> they really are. They're not, I mean, they're taking advantage of it. Uh, range of SR, I'd say anywhere from like a beginner level up to, I think we had a, a, at 500. least top 500. Yeah, we had two there. Yeah, so it's pretty dramatic, but we tried to split it out. So very tight play here. Again, just not able to make it. But see, yeah. But see, again, they're treating, Fire is treating this as if this is their last stand, every one of them. They're setting up the healing correctly, they're protecting their healers, they're not allowing any openings at all, so there's no slack here. So it's really hard for Water to get any sort of momentum. You can kind of see now Water Team's abandoned their two healer approach. Yeah. I think they're just kind of running on life support here, they just want to make something happen. Again, it's the difference between teams trying to be the playmaker and teams trying to like win the game. You see these maze getting reckless, just trying to make something happen. Yeah. Tough game, tough game. Disappointing to see it at the end. All right, well, we want to thank you guys all for watching. Those are some exciting games. We'll be back next week. Um, Same bad channel. Yeah, exactly. Um... Yeah, we will. So, Risky, we are doing a new, uh, we will do a new uh, season after this one.